Hi, Linda Bowen here from StampingWithLinda.com, your cardiologist since 1997, helping you create cards from the heart. Today is just a quick video um, I wanted to share with you with the prized peony bundle. Now, I bought this bundle and I was a little bit intimidated uh, by it, not so much by the flowers. I have shared a couple um, videos with that, but it was with the layering of the peony flowers. So I wanted to show you how simple this is and how sometimes we procrastinate about something thinking it's going to be harder than it actually is. There are four different dies um, and you want to cut them out. I cut them out in white and then I used the um, bumblebee um, in color cardstock to cut out the little stamen. So I'm just going to set this aside and show you how simple it was to put this uh, peony together. I went ahead and took my magenta madness and a sponge dauber, sponged around um, the different pieces. I like to take a glue dot to kind of hold my stamen in. And the thing is you need to build. They all have a little curve at the bottom and we're going to be building with that. I'm just going to put that little stamen um, right and my flower a little harder to get in at first with that glue dot but it just kind of holds it in place and then what you want to do is you want to take the next piece and you're just going to go right inside like that again because of that glue dot you need to just kind of work with it a little bit to get it in but I just find that helps hold it in place and we're just going to turn it over and we are going to line up those two pieces so see how the curve is then we're going to go in and grab the next piece again sliding it in you get such a different look every time depending on how you sponge or if you use just one color. Again, lining those edges up and then finally taking the bigger one and doing the same thing, pulling it down and lining up those tabs. And that's all it is to it. Again, I procrastinated about this over and over and I really didn't have to. I am going to go ahead and add some adhesive. You know what, I think I'm going to go ahead and find a glue or a dimensional. I haven't done it with a dimensional. I think I'm going to just grab a long dimensional and put across there like so to pop it up. Then what I'm going to do is go get the cards and more from the Flower of All Seasons. I love, love, love these cards. It makes card making so easy. And I'm just going to take that peony. Let's go ahead and fold this card in half and then I'm going to lay that peony up in the corner. I've already taken the three leaves and I've been cut them out with the dies so we're just going to set them up there and then I run, run them through the supple um, embossing folder and it just gave those leaves a nice texture. I don't know if you can see it very well um, on the video. I'm going to go in and Grab a glue dot, slip those leaves underneath. I mean, how quick is this card? I mean, just so, so quick. And the thing is, you could make several of these and not put a verse on them. And then when you needed a verse, you could go right in and stamp. I'm going to grab my verse. I never have enough thank yous. And so I'm going to ink that with a memento ink. Stamp it on my card and there we have it. A very quick card using that new uh, peony die. Hope you give it a try. Talk to you real soon. Bye-bye.